is up guys this is Raven how are you guys doing today because today we're gonna review a deck box yesterday Kovac bought herself a deck box that I never bought like you know uh, the one that I would never buy normally so I figured like you know what I'm gonna review that this is an ultra pro M2 deck box I was never a fan of a fan of those I always you know bought the normal deck boxes or like the short ones so they open easy like I don't like more containers but she bought it so I like okay you know what let's let's review that so that's how the uh, box looks like we've got a removable for the dice tokens and other accessories container and we've got removable container for the deck all right but this is just just a box I'm gonna I'm gonna leave the box right over here so you, you, you can see what we're dealing with but the deck box looks like that and I must admit it's a nice nice finish like looks tough as hell it's almost leather like which is really cool like I like the finish uh, one like I kind of enjoy that if you have a container you've got a small gap over here but maybe maybe it's gonna you know like go away someday or I'm not gonna be too drunk to, to, to see that nah kidding so looks super solid but first we've got dices and we've got deck inside but so this opens right here just like that and we've got a second container that opens here with dices so you know what we're gonna check you see there's an opening so let's see how easy it is to open it <laughs> holy hell okay it's not oh, what about Okay, I think I I must admit this this is not opening that easy. So let's see how it looks inside actually. So let's open it. So if when you're gonna open it, you've got the storage for your deck box. And oh yeah, retrieving the deck the deck is yeah, retrieving the deck is gonna be a little bit pain of the in the ass. But this is how the storage for the deck box looks like. Those are double sleeved cards like few on the front are just empty sleeves for me but inside we got normal normal deck as you can tell we got some green ninjas action going on we got some there we go that's a green ninja those are those amazing wizards of the coast 2002 hmm, energies no I'm, uh, like actually they are but so really i thought i can oh how it's gonna fit there like uh it looks because without a deck inside i can tell you like this this doesn't look, you know, that it can hold a deck. It just doesn't. It looks flimsy. It looks, you know, not good and not solid. But actually it is. And actually it fits a deck, double sleeve deck, right there. Like, it's kind of pain to put it inside. But you can, you know, can get over it. Uh, with it, you've got, you know, this nice hole right here. You can, if you want, you can do this. But whoever would want to do that. But the second container is what I was interested the most so let's see this is the second container uh, as you can guess you cannot go from the bottom right you cannot go there from the bottom you have to go from oh yeah this is gonna be so this is for a container for coins for us Pokemon players for coins for uh, dices and the fact that you have to do this yeah like you, you, you can tell like this is this is gonna be annoying but it does does actually contain it can contain oh shit <laughs> a lot of dices but the fact that you have to you know get it upside down and like actually freaking pulled it can be annoying but overall like this is solid this is super solid oh this is super solid okay so easy it goes right over and slides into spot so leaves a little bit of like you know space over here it's not that annoying like if you need only dices you can you know only get to the dices it's okay it's a really nice matte finish I don't know like the durability that, that is what struck me because I love deck boxes that actually can take a beating that actually you know you can do a lot of stuff to them and they're not gonna you know destroy your deck they're not gonna open 
your dice are not gonna fly all, all over the place or in your backpack whenever you, you you know you're gonna have your deck and the fact that this is super hard like this is I don't know if you can hear this is super hard it really protects your deck I'm real and the price is even okay the price that we paid is around 12 bucks so it's, it's gonna be around 10 euros for, for your European guys uh, so it's it's not that bad, like one kind of thing, I don't know if you can, I don't think you will be able to see that, is like there is this one, like one spot over here that is looking like someone, yeah, like someone would have pressed it and it's like a little, little hole. But that's just like, that. that's my only complaint, like actually the deck box is really damn good, I might buy one for myself. And you know, and you can of course see, yeah. You can clearly see uh, the connections where where it connects when it, you close it. So overall, like my opinion overall, if uh, you're looking for a really good deck box, like a really good deck box with a nice storage for your uh, for your for your double sleeved cards, because not every deck box can contain storage uh, can contain double sleeved cards. Like Pokeball one, he can't contain cards at all. But 75 double sleep cards, because that's what's advertised, and I can tell you it's definitely around 75, even 80, I would say. Uh, and your uh, and your dices, because you don't you hate you know going with like you know pack of dices all over you know whatever you're gonna put it. I hate it. I hate it personally. I hate it that I have to you know bring a pack of dices uh, with me all the time. So in that box, and actually like. <clears throat> Go, go! Nothing. Nothing's gonna happen. Like nothing. Literally. Like, I tried. You know this. So this this would go away. No. Really solid deck box. Cheap deck box. I, I must admit. Like this is one of the, you know. It's not like high end deck box for like hundred bucks. It's twelve. But it's ultra pro and it's super solid. Like I am surprised how solid it is. So I can highly highly recommend it for everyone who enjoys like those. The types of deck boxes, those high deck boxes, they come with different colors. You can have pink, you can have green, you can have you know lemon, you can have brown, white. You know, we got uh, white and uh, and red. It's okay. There was a pink as well, but you know, Kovac wanted this one, and it's heavy. Like it is really damn heavy. If you have you know deck boxes and and uh, if you have deck boxes, if you have uh, cards inside, but all in all. Surprisingly, like you, you saw me at the beginning of the video, I was not a fan, not a fan, but it, it grew on me. It grew on me during this review. It really grew on me how, like you know, how solid it is. The durability. Wow, just wow. So for me, that is a solid ten out of ten. Ten out of ten. I, I can easily go ten out of ten. Why not? This one little, you know. This, this bothers me because it th those type of things annoys me. Like, there's this one space here that it's not, you know, matching. But it's clearly 10 out of 10. Great deck box. I, I know I would buy myself one. Probably. Or, or maybe a different one. But if I would be tight on budget and I needed a high quality deck box. This is the deck box to go. Definitely Ultra Pro done a really really good job with the deck box. Like just look at it. Look how beautiful it looks. Up. So my thumb goes up just like no, just like the deck box says. And you can do oh, I had my finger there. <laughs> so 10 out of 10 Ultra Pro M2. Like this is this is it. This is M2 to deck box so if you're looking for a great deck box look no further m2 deck box is all you need in your life currently so thank you guys very much for watching this amazing review i know i stumbled a few times i know i know i know but we're just starting out with those reviews and if you enjoy those reviews if you want to see more reviews of the products to protect that protect cards and you know play mats sleeves other things let me know in the comment section down there below. Uh, I would love to review some more of those stuff. 
because I think they are, you know, they're a necessity for everyone who plays card games, especially IRL. So, is it Magic? Is it Pokemon? Is it Yu-Gi-Oh? We all need the deck box. We all need sleeves, and some are, some are better than the others. And I can tell you, M2. I had many deck boxes, and you will see that on, on the one video. And this is this is gonna be like in top three of deck boxes. Like really, this is gonna be a top three, even top two, I would say, of the deck boxes that I own. And really. It is a great, great, great deck box. M2, you're a good deck box. 10 out of 10. Thank you guys very much for watching this video. Right down there below, you have a 5% discount on Professor Oak for any code you would like to buy for Pokemon TCG Online. So check that, check that one out. Support your, your boy Raven. And subscribe to this channel for more content like that, for more analysis, for more deck creation. Blah. For more decks, for Pokemon TCGO, for more pack openings, for more weird stuff that is happening. Thank you guys very much. Raven loves ya. Bye.